These are Lyme disease spirochetes. And if you were looking at a gingival sulcus and saw these spirochetes, they look the same as any spirochete you would see in the oral cavity. But these spirochetes have the ability to move through the tissue. This is tissue from a Lyme disease lesion. And they have that ability to move through the tissue. These two spirochetes, this, they're thought to have some kind of a mating uh, dance going on here, but again, no research is available to show exactly how they reproduce. Here are spirochetes again. This is a cell membrane, and we're going to watch these spirochetes, how they can move through a cell membrane. Here's one moving out of the cell membrane. Uh, this one's going to penetrate through the cell membrane, which indicates that spirochetes can move through cell membranes and they can pretty much get anywhere they want to go in the body. Uh, this is a, a lymphocyte and it's going to consume this uh, spirochete and it may be the lymphocytes that actually come in and uh, do their job on spirochetes. Again, these uh, videos uh, came from uh, Dr. McDonald's research in Lyme disease.